Have you ever wondered how a city can rise from the desert, transforming into an ultra-modern metropolis in just a few decades? Let's rewind time and journey back to a period around 5,000 years ago, where our story begins. In the heart of the Arabian Desert, as early as 3000 BC, the area now known as Dubai was a harsh, unforgiving landscape. It was home to a hardy breed of nomadic cattle herders who braved the scorching sun and shifting sands. These early inhabitants led a simple life, constantly on the move in search of greener pastures for their cattle. As centuries rolled on, these nomadic tribes began to settle down. By the 18th century, the relentless desert had given way to a charming small fishing village along the creek. This creek or core as it was locally known, was more than just a source of water. It was the lifeblood of the village, teeming with a rich variety of fish and providing a natural harbor for Dow trading vessels. The villagers were skilled pearl divers, braving the depths of the Arabian Gulf in search of the prized gemstones. The village's strategic location along the trading routes between India and East Africa did not go unnoticed, Traders and merchants began to frequent the area, and soon the village evolved into a bustling trading port. The seeds for Dubai's transformation were quietly being sown, but it was more than just location and resources that set the stage for Dubai's metamorphosis. The villagers' spirit of resilience, their readiness to adapt, and their unwavering belief in a brighter future were the true driving forces behind Dubai's incredible journey. So, there it was, a humble fishing village nestled along a creek, oblivious to the extraordinary destiny that awaited it. From a modest fishing village, Dubai was on the cusp of an incredible transformation. What events led to the transformation of this small fishing village into an important trading hub? Dubai's metamorphosis from a humble pearl fishing village to a global trading hub is a tale steeped in resilience, foresight, and fortuitous events. One such pivotal event was the signing of the Exclusive Agreement in 1892. This agreement was a significant turning point, marking Dubai's transition from obscurity to prominence. Under the terms of this agreement, the rulers of the Trucial states including Dubai, surrendered control of their foreign affairs to the British. In return, the British pledged to protect the Trucial states from all aggression by sea, and to lend their support in case of land attack. This protection allowed the region to enjoy relative peace, which in turn, encouraged trade. Dubai's strategic location between Europe, Africa and the East proved to be a boon. It soon thrived as a bustling trading port. The city's liberal attitudes coupled with the significant pearl trade, attracted merchants from India and Persia, further bolstering its economy. However, the real game-changer was yet to come. In the late 1960s a new chapter was added to Dubai's narrative with the discovery of oil. This black gold, as it's often referred to, revolutionized Dubai's economy and set the stage for its future growth. The revenue generated from oil exports was wisely invested in infrastructure development, paving the way for Dubai's evolution into a modern city. The impact of oil on Dubai's economy cannot be overstated. It provided the means for the city to diversify its economy, reducing its reliance on traditional sectors like trade and pearl fishing. The city gradually became a magnet for international businesses, transforming into an important commercial hub. The discovery of oil therefore was not just a boon for Dubai's economy, but it also shaped its identity. It was a catalyst that propelled the city towards growth and modernization, allowing it to carve a distinct niche for itself on the global stage. With the discovery of oil, Dubai was propelled towards unimaginable growth. How did the discovery of oil fuel the rapid development of Dubai? Let's delve into that. In the late 1960s, black gold, as oil is often called, was discovered off the coast of Dubai. This was a turning point in the city's history. The revenues generated from this newfound resource were not squandered, but meticulously invested back into the city itself. The goal was clear, to modernize and develop Dubai, transforming it from a small trading hub into a significant player on the world stage. The oil boom brought about a flurry of development, Infrastructure became a priority, with roads, bridges and buildings springing up at an astonishing rate. But it wasn't just about physical structures. The government also focused on establishing strong public services and a robust education system, understanding that a city's true strength lies in its people and their capabilities. In the mid-70s Dubai took to the skies with the establishment of Emirates Airlines. This wasn't just about providing a means of transportation, it was a strategic move to connect Dubai with the rest of the world, making it a global crossroads and a hub for international commerce and tourism. Around the same time, 
the construction of Jebel Ali port began. This wasn't just any port, it was designed to be one of the largest man-made harbors and the biggest port in the Middle East. This was a clear statement of intent. Dubai was positioning itself as a vital link in global trade, open and inviting to businesses from around the world. The oil boom, therefore, was not just about wealth. It was a catalyst that sparked a vision, a rapid transformation that turned a small desert city into a bustling metropolis. The revenues from oil were the fuel, but the drive came from a vision of progress and development, a desire to create a city that was not just rich in resources, but rich in opportunities and possibilities. Dubai was now a city on the rise attracting attention from around the world. What visionary steps transformed Dubai into a global city? Let's delve into this fascinating tale. The leadership of Dubai, recognizing the finite nature of oil reserves, made a bold decision to diversify the economy, setting the stage for an evolution that would be nothing short of extraordinary. The vision was expansive, yet focused. Dubai was not just to be another city, but a global city, a beacon of progress, innovation, an opportunity that would attract people from all corners of the globe. And so began a concerted effort to develop sectors that would propel Dubai onto the world stage. Tourism was one such sector. Dubai's leaders recognized the potential of their city's unique blend of sun, sand, and sea. They set out to create a world-class tourism industry, investing heavily in infrastructure, attractions, and services. The result? Today Dubai is a tourist mecca, drawing millions of visitors each year with its luxurious hotels, breathtaking skyscrapers, and vibrant cultural scene. Next came the real estate boom. The cityscape was transformed as Dubai's skyline began to rival those of established global cities. Iconic structures such as the Burj Khalifa and the Palm Jumeirah became symbols of Dubai's ambition and architectural prowess. This growth was not just about aesthetics but a strategic move to attract international businesses and affluent individuals, further solidifying Dubai's status as a global city. The development of the financial services sector was another masterstroke. Dubai established itself as a hub for banking and finance in the Middle East, attracting major global financial institutions. The Dubai International Financial Center, an onshore financial hub, further cemented the city's position in the global financial landscape. The leadership's vision was met with remarkable success. But this success was not accidental. It was the result of careful planning, strategic investment, and an unwavering commitment to the vision of a global city. The vision was clear, Dubai was to become a global city, and nothing was going to stand in its way. And indeed, nothing did. The city that once emerged from the sands now stands tall, a testament to the power of vision, ambition, and resilience. What does modern Dubai look like and how does it continue to evolve? Well, picture a cityscape punctuated by the gleaming spire of the Burj Khalifa, the tallest building in the world, standing at a staggering 828 meters. Its needle-like point pierces the sky, an embodiment of Dubai's aspirations. Now imagine an island, but not just any island. The Palm Jumeirah, a man-made marvel, stretches out into the turquoise waters of the Arabian Gulf. This palm-shaped island is a testament to Dubai's engineering ingenuity and ambition. Its fronds are adorned with luxury villas while the trunk boasts high-end apartments and hotels. Then there's the Dubai Mall, a consumer's paradise. It's not just a shopping center, it's a hub of entertainment and gastronomy, boasting over a thousand stores, an aquarium, a theme park, and even a full-size ice rink. But Dubai doesn't rest on its laurels. The city is committed to pushing the boundaries of innovation. Take the Hyperloop, for instance. This high-speed transportation concept, once a pipe dream, is inching closer to reality in Dubai. It promises to revolutionize travel, shrinking the time it takes to traverse the city. And let's not forget the museum of the future. This architectural marvel, shaped like a torus, is not just a museum. It's a vision of what the future could be, a place where innovative ideas are born and nurtured. These landmarks and projects are not just structures, they are symbols of Dubai's relentless pursuit of progress. They represent the city's transformation from a humble trading hub to a global metropolis, a city that dares to dream big and has the audacity to turn those dreams into reality. And so, we come full circle. From a city born in the sands, Dubai has grown, evolved, and transformed. Today it stands as a beacon of innovation, a testament to human ambition, and a symbol of what is possible when vision, determination, and resourcefulness come together. Dubai, a city that rose from the sands, now stands tall as a global metropolis. 
What is the spirit that drives Dubai's relentless growth and transformation? It's a question that invites us on a journey, a journey into the heart of a city that has defied the odds and emerged from the desert sands to touch the sky. At the core of Dubai's spirit is a resilience that is as enduring as the desert itself. Time and again, this city has faced challenges and emerged stronger, thriving amidst adversity. From its humble beginnings as a small fishing village on the edge of the Arabian Peninsula, Dubai has weathered economic storms, navigated geopolitical shifts, and endured environmental challenges to become the bustling metropolis it is today. But resilience alone doesn't capture the essence of Dubai. This is a city that is driven by ambition, a city that is always reaching for the stars. It's an ambition that has propelled Dubai's growth, an ambition that has seen it build the tallest skyscraper, the largest mall, and the most luxurious hotels. Dubai's ambition is not just about achieving great heights, it's about redefining what's possible, about pushing the boundaries of human achievement. And then there is innovation. In Dubai it's not just about building bigger and better, it's about building smarter. This city is constantly reinventing itself, embracing cutting-edge technologies and pioneering new ways of doing things. Whether it's the Hyperloop, the world's first functional 3D printed building, or its ambitious plans to be a global leader in green energy, Dubai is committed to innovation. It's a commitment that is shaping its future, setting it on a path to becoming a smart, sustainable city of tomorrow. Dubai's spirit is not just about resilience, ambition and innovation. It's about the fusion of these elements, the synergy that propels it forward. It's about a city that never rests, that never stops dreaming, that never stops striving. The spirit of Dubai, ambition, resilience and innovation continues to shape its destiny. As we look back on Dubai's remarkable journey, what are the key takeaways? Let's travel back in time, shall we? Dubai, a city sprung from the sands, was once a humble fishing village, its people eking out a living from the sea. But even then, it was a place of dreams and possibilities, a crossroads where cultures met and mingled, laying the foundation for a dynamic, diverse city. As the years rolled on, Dubai morphed into a bustling trading hub, the discovery of oil in the late 1960s fueled an unprecedented period of growth and development. Skyscrapers began to rise, piercing the clear desert sky as the city's skyline took shape. Dubai was on the move, racing towards a future of prosperity and progress. This rapid transformation was not by chance but the result of a clear vision, a vision of a global city. The leaders of Dubai dreamt big and they had the audacity to turn those dreams into reality. They envisioned a city that was not only rich in wealth but also in culture, innovation and ambition. And so, modern Dubai came to be. Today it's a global metropolis, a place where the world comes to meet. From the gleaming towers of its business district to the vibrant cultures of its residents, Dubai is a testament to the power of human ambition. But the spirit of Dubai, its essence, is perhaps its most compelling feature. This city is more than its buildings, more than its wealth. It's a place of dreams, a place where anything is possible, a place that inspires and invites us to look beyond what is to what could be. Dubai's story is a testament to human ambition and the power of visionary leadership. As we look to the future we can only wonder, what's next for this remarkable city?